I want to see exactly how they're going to handle all of the spending problems we've got in D.C. and how dysfunctional it is. We want real answers. We want specifics. We're smart in South Carolina. That's what we love to talk about as policy. That's what we're inviting the candidates to do. And the candidates who aren't here tonight, uh, should they pay a price for not coming here to this debate if they're already in the race? The candidates that are here have said that they understand that South Carolina is important. The candidates that haven't made it here have some time to make up. They've got some more extra work that they've got to do. But I will tell you, we've heard from all the candidates. They're coming. It's go time. It starts tonight. If you're Mitt Romney, though, why shouldn't he be here at this debate? Why shouldn't South Carolinians hear from him? You know, I think that they make their own strategic decisions. What I will tell you is we've heard from um, Governor Romney. He's coming the end of the month. We've also heard from Trump. He's coming the end of the month. Michelle Bachman was just here. You're going to see these candidates tonight. They're all going to start coming, and South Carolinians are ready to listen. But so many of the candidates say this is way too early to have a debate in their state. It may be too early for them. It's not too early for people in South Carolina. Are you satisfied with the field as it is right now? You know, I think you're asking me if I want to see a different personality in there. This is all about policy. I think we saw what happened in the last election when we looked at personality. This is all about substance. This is all about results. That's what we care about. Governor Haley, what do you want to see on the debate stage tonight specifically? I want to hear specifics. I want to hear about the NLRB lawsuit. I want to hear about the gas prices that we're dealing with. I want to hear about the debt ceiling, what they're going to do when it comes to spending. I want to know the value of the dollar and what they're going to do to change. Last question. Do you worry that there's going to be too much talk about this on the lot and uh, I think there needs to be talk about Bin Laden. I think we need to talk about what's that next step. This is a great day to be an American. But what I will tell you is now we're going to see where the war on terror steps up. They're going to try and show that they are still relevant. And how is this next person going to handle being president when we have to deal with it? Thank you all very much. I appreciate it. Thank you.